Huge layoffs expected. You're watching WKYT. I'm Kristen Kennedy. One of the nation's largest private coal producers may soon take on one of the largest layoffs in history. Murray Energy Corporation told workers they may lay off as many as 4,400 people. WKYT's Sabira Rayford talks to industry leaders about the impact on Kentucky in our top story at six. Murray Energy is the largest privately owned coal miner in the U.S., and now they're warning that big cuts are ahead. I talked to the president of the Kentucky Coal Association, Bill Bissett, and he says this is just the beginning. Kentucky is a coal mining state that produces steam coal, electricity generating coal, and if we're not creating electricity with it, there's nowhere to go, and that's why people lose their jobs. Murray Energy is threatened to cut over 4,000 jobs, which is close to 80 percent of its workforce. For every one job lost, we lose at least three other indirect jobs for every coal miner that loses his job. So it's a serious concern for eastern Kentucky, but that concern has grown now. Now we see in western Kentucky, which is where Murray Energy's operations are located in Kentucky, they're now talking about layoffs. Other countries have had layoffs. The price of coal has declined over the years, and business says companies are laying off employees to catch up with the market. We're eventually going to have a production that meets our market. Uh, production is going to come offline. Less coal is going to get mined. Less people are going to be employed. We will be mining coal in Kentucky. Uh, probably the best we can hope for is to hang on to what we have right now. But the truth of it is, as those coal-fired power plants are retired and new ones are not being built, we will only continue to contract. And that's the reality of it for until things change either politically or they see our product in a different light. The law requires a 60 day waiting period before a large layoff can occur. In Lexington, Sabir Rayford, WKYT. Murray Energy says if the layoffs happen, they will be sometime this September.